Yo guys, hit the like button below and also I realize a lot of you aren't subscribed so if you want to help me out, please subscribe. This game here is in Masters 300 LP MMR. We're playing against Nasus mid lane, which is really annoying, but we go Conqueror because uh, I guess right now I just enjoy Conqueror the most. And the game plan against Nasus is usually just to like get your first recall and then start roaming after level 6 because you can't really fight him. He's like really strong. Um, after level 6, even if you have a couple kills on him, he can run you down very easily with his ult and his Qs and his W and everything. So you have to be really careful. So you don't want to level your first um, spell straight away. You want to wait just in case something like this happens. So I have to W away from the invade. But then again, I should have been watching my bot lane and they weren't covering. So if your team doesn't cover, then you usually shouldn't cover as well. So now I have W start in a Nasus lane, which is really annoying. So if I forward it a bit, he starts E and he just pokes me. And yeah, I have no Q. But the good thing about that E that he did there is it pushes towards me faster. So you want to just hug your minions as much as you can um, in the early game. So the way he pushes like this, use my W backwards. And yeah, there's not much to do. Um... In the early game, because I started Q, uh, W, but yeah, even if I had Q, it's pretty hard because Nasus has Aerie and E, so he can just keep his distance and just keep using E and get push. So it's pretty strong from Nasus. So now I'm about to hit level three, and I want to take a trade W E Q just like that, get some cut down damage, some scorch damage. Now I go in knowing that I have Conqueror stacks, I extend the trade. That's what you want to do with Conqueror. Then I need to run away, make sure I get the cannon. And I see he used Ghost. I know he doesn't have Flash. So I know I'm going to Flash on him if he shows up. Around the corner, just like that, straight away. Flash W, Q, Auto E, whatever that was. We kill him and we push the wave. And then I think Talia comes out of nowhere to kill me. Which is quite sad. Cut the clip. So now I'm back in lane. Nasus roamed bot and he's a bit lower than full HP. Right there. I W E and then I miss the Qs and usually when you have Conqueror and you miss the Qs you don't want to go in because you don't get the Conk stacks and they'll be more healthier than you would want them to be. And I see the enemy jungler on the left but I know I have no W so I walk up to E the Nasus then realize I want the cannon as well. Now I have W for Talia, we just kill him like that. It's very important I walk up to E the Nasus just to get my W back otherwise it could get like more annoying to play and we could get outplayed I guess. But yeah, we kill them both and we get push. So I'm going to show you guys how to play when you're about to hit level 6. Um, so as said, you want to use your WEQ, try to get the conk stacks as well. Uh, when you're just a few minions off 6 and you know that you're going to hit 6 first. So I do that and I have W again. So I WQ to keep my stacks. And then I walk up to get level 6, take the W. And from there you just auto, you ult, you Q, you auto E. And then you take the ult shadow. Usually you'd survive, but jungle gap. Right here I'm going to show you guys 3 man on the Nasus, just to kill him. And make sure you try your best to get the kills, like when you're getting help like this from your team. Uh, because then it's like really really good. But if the, you know, if your teammate gets the kills, then it might not be as good. Right here I roam bot knowing that my team has Karth Assault. So I'm like, yeah, this is pretty good. But then I end up missing my Q. <laughs> Which is really bad, but then we got his flash. Trading flashes with the Draven who's fed is... Pretty good, and I got the shutdown, so at the end of the day, it's not the worst. So I'm laning mid a bit, fighting Nasus and taking waves, but then I realize the enemy Draven is uh, really overextended. So instead of helping my Hecarim right there, I just teleport into bot lane. We see the ward, but it's fine. A WEQ, knowing that he has no flash, so all the Qs should hit, which they do. And then I'm trying to KS the Leona, and I fail. Garth is missing every Q, but he gets the last one. So sad. So I shove mid and Nasus teleports bot to kill the Karthus and Talia wastes her spell right there so I know I can kill her. The way I go in is like this, with Conqueror you want to use your spells first to try and get all your stacks and then ult. And then I just Q and I flash as well, he was a big shutdown. So we're getting nice and fed from this uh, free Talia kill. I'm about to head bot lane and then my team starts fighting so I turn around. And the key I'm looking for is just the way to go all in, probably for the Draven. So I find it right there, WQW, ult onto him, the Karthus Q landed as well, which helped a lot. We kill Nasus, and then I just jump on this Talia as well. 
try to kill this Leona. And we kill her as well. And right here I think that I have enough items and stuff to fight Darius. Because I was like up a whole item I think. But it was actually not even close. I would have got a completely one shot. Luckily my jungler's there with their jungler. But it's fine because Hecarim just AoE'd them. And we kill them both. And now I'm going mid. I'm pretty strong. I have three, four items including boots. I'm looking for the angle. So I see one on Talia. Go straight for her. And then she has Zonia's, so it's a bit awkward. I don't want to turn on Draven, because I want to kill Talia first. And then Draven. I think I failed one of my Q's, or my WQ right there, but it's fine. We kill him, and then I also get another W to get out just in time. W right away from the Dari Assault. Um, and then just wait on the outskirts of the fight to finish them off. But then after all of that, I end up overextending <laughs> and just farming way too much. And when they kill me, they end up going for Baron, so if I forwarded a bunch... Uh, I ping my team away, but then the Hecarim runs in and dies anyways. Which is quite sad. But that's fine. I forward it until I'm alive. So I have to teleport in. As I TP in, I'm thinking about what to do. So, uh, I'm just like, well, Darius is kind of strong. If he autos me, he gets his passive thing. But it's fine, we can W ult. You know, just do a bunch of that. Leona died. I'm thinking about how to kill Talia. Right now I place a W, and then I just want to E the Nasus, so that I get another W, and I take the W, and my W's back up. <laughs> but yeah, that's kind of how I played it right there. And then I'm like, oh, well, the Dravenaut wouldn't kill me anyways, why did I try to dodge it? But then I end up getting away, so not too shabby. Here's a quick int fight by me. So I go in, I ult, and then I wanted to W, and then take my ult shadow, just to get more AoE, but then I get stunned, and I die. After that, they just pushed a bunch of mid towers, but now I'm bot lane thinking about how to kill Darius. I know I have Sona right next to me, so I'm not scared. W, E, Q like this. Ping that I'm going in. W and then auto E before I ult. You want to do a melee range auto E before you ult usually, just to get another W up. Here's another blow up on the Darius. We W, W, auto E, and then we auto E again to get another W, and then we ult. Just to get the W onto him and just kill him like that. So right now we're posturing for Baron and looking for the angle. Sona goes in like that, so I just WQW flash auto E profane onto Draven, knowing that I would kill him. And as soon as I kill Draven, I understand that I killed him quite quickly. So I take it quite slow, waiting for the Talia Zonias to finish, instead of going for someone else, and then killing Talia first. So now we're posturing for Elder, we're kind of fighting, but then I get withered by Nasus, and I realize, ah, this is actually really bad. So I have to W ult him. Um, which is really really bad. I'm thinking well we kind of lost the game <laughs> like when I did that because I don't have ult and Elder is up but now I know the way to play is just use W E Q and then wait and never take your W's so this is how you want to play when you don't have ult just showing you real quick I know I have Serpent so I want to combo this Darius and then go in on him because it's fine and I know I can kill him and yeah just playing nice and slow I don't need to waste W on this Talia and yep just waiting and waiting. Karthus manages to kill Nasus. Talia inted, so I use my W on the Leona. Then I take the W, auto E, or just the E actually, because I'm scared still. And then I combo him to kill him. We go straight on the Draven as well. Miss a Q, but it's fine. And yeah, we pretty much push for the end after that. So yeah, thank you so much for watching this video. I hope it was useful, and I'll see you in the next one. Peace. In